The mountain bongo is a large, shy antelope endemic to Kenya's indigenous forests. It must be the most handsome, beautiful um, antelope in the world. But due to habitat destruction and hunting, the mountain bongo is on the brink of extinction, with just 103 remaining in the wild. The mountain bongo is now the most threatened antelope in Kenya, and possibly the most endangered large land mammal south of the Sahara. The situation for bongo today is as grave as it was for black rhino and elephant in the late 80s. Recent population models predict bongo could be extinct in the wild in as little as 14 years. So they obviously pushed into little tiny corners where there's lots of food and water and that's where they stay basically. This is their chance of survival. I mean, if they weren't a retiring animal like this and very shy, there wouldn't be any left, probably. This was the beginning of the Bongo Surveillance Project. Intensive research estimated that there were still some bongo surviving. But as much illegal logging and poaching was discovered during extensive field trips, especially the need to conserve their forest habitat has become highly important. To reach this goal, it was vital to work closely with the communities and the nearby schools. There's no hope, I really can tell you, without the local population. And the best way of getting at the locals is through their school kids. That's why Mike founded the Bongo Wildlife Club, which now totals nine schools. The wildlife clubs include conservation education to classroom presentations, films and visits to national parks, as most pupils and teachers have never been to a park before. Further, the schools have planted nearly 3,000 indigenous trees. Through BSP support, new farming methods had been shown. The BSP has also introduced alternative cooking initiatives and new technologies to these communities. The success of re-establishing the bongo depends upon the support and the commitment of the people of Kenya. They must ensure the protection and preservation of their environment. Conservation cannot be a preserve of given few institutions in Kenya. And every effort therefore counts. Fortunately, the funding for the Bogo uh, conservation is coming from uh, the ESAP. Fortunately, because within the ESAP, the possibility to build up into the previous uh, uh, initiative is always there. And especially if you are creating good impact. Mm -hmm.